How many times have you done this? A lot of times. For the last few years. Really? Yeah. Do you just, do you just play guitar at the church or do you do more? No, I never play guitar at the church. It's asking me to play guitar. Oh. But I just play for a living, you know. Oh, okay. But um, as far as going back to the real important question about this, the Bible says in John chapter 14, verse 12, Jesus said if you're an actual believer, not someone that goes to church, not someone who says, well, I kind of believe in Jesus, you know, but actually a believer that follows him and is in love with him that tries to do the right things. And um, he'll give you the same, um, so the works that I do are greater shall you do because he's going to the Father. See, Jesus came and he left. He's taking care of everything, but he's letting us do this stuff now because it's authority. And a lot of people don't believe that. And then the ones that do like me, they're crazy, they're radical, they're over the Lord, you know, but it doesn't matter because I'm just doing what the Lord wants me to do. And it's real simple. He said when you when he when you when he came, he came to give us life and that more abundantly. Doesn't I mean I always gotta figure it out. But I mean he gives us power. It's a trip, dude. It's a total trip. And it's not religion, it's it's like relationship. It's a true relationship. When you came in, I decided to play a worship song first night the time all night. I don't know, you came in, well, said this is the beginning of the song I was gonna do a worship song. And then you guys were leaving, I was like, all right, they're gonna leave. But then when you said, hey, the Lord goes, go get him, son, because I'm his kid, you know. So you said on a scale of one to ten it was like an eight as far as pain. And now it's at a one. If you don't want to send the internet, it's okay. Because I just like to tell people that it's out there. People are like, wow, that's a trip, you know? But uh, I'm gonna pray for it right now and it's gonna be gone. You ready? That's awfully close. In the name of Jesus. Just close your eyes for a minute. Thank you, Father. One more time, Lord. Just let it go. I just bind this pain right now in the name of Jesus. Any assignments against Brian in the name of Jesus, I just break it off him right now. And more than that, I pray, Father God, that you would open up his ears and he would hear you, Father. <laughs> Jesus' name. The Lord says that, that you have kids or you got one on the way? We have two and one on the way. You, okay, because the Lord says he's really going to do something with the one that's on the way. Okay. Um, I didn't really look, so I don't know if you got a belly going on or whatever, but the Lord just spoke to me about one that's on the way. And... <clears throat> And the Lord wants to change your heart, Brian. He wants you um, to to know Him. He, he wants you to go home and go, not, wow, that guy Dave, wow. Of course, sure, yeah, I'd freak out. Some dude pray for me. Yeah, this is like uh, amazing. Really weird. It's really weird. It's going away, right? It's gone. No, just, yeah, where, where you're coming from and going with this. Yes. It's, it's really... Yes, strange. And, and enlightening, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Really? yeah listen, I guess enlightening. Listen, to, listen to the Lord right now. Your wife's not getting it as much as you are, but that's okay. No judgment, no condemnation, no. I'm cooler than you because I know the law. It's, it's the Lord is really calling you to a strong place, and He wants you to be a strong father to your kids, mm -hmm. and, and and the father that your father couldn't be for you. You know. And uh, how's your relationship with your dad? I love my dad. Yeah. Yeah, I do. How's it really? I, mean, I, I don't hardly get to talk to him because he's, he's in California. He's in California, and not only like that, but he, it's hard to get a hold of him. It, okay. I just teared up when I talked about your dad. Something's going on with you and your dad. Is that about right? All right. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. I want you to know I could never guess that. I could never guess. Yeah, hey, I know. That's what but, I mean. It's but I mean, I'm praying. I go, ooh, I just teared up because I could feel there's a there's a hurt there between you and him. But the Lord says that he he's going to be the father your father never was, and he's going to make you the father that your father wasn't. And he's gonna, you know, he's gonna change you. He wants to change you, Brian, and make you to, into this amazing man. You, you know, you're we called to be. Have. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that I know. I can look at how happy your wife is. <clears throat> I can tell you're a lover, man. That's good. But the Lord wants to take you deeper. You know, you can go to McDonald's every day or a Euro place every day, and I become a Euro or a McDonald's sandwich, right? And you can go to church. Doesn't mean you're a Christian. Jesus said, you know that. Um, you know, he, he wants us to be born again. You know. And, you know, you get my card if you want to talk again, that'd be cool. But is that pain gone totally? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Not even a one, right? No. Okay, amen. Yeah, that's, that's weird. Yeah. That's strange. That's great. Amen, right? Right. Right. <laughs>
Lord, so we just, come here, we're going to both pray for you. Can, is it okay? Oh, sure. Right, come on closer. Come touch your husband. <coughs> Lord, yes, me and Stephanie just bless this family, Father God. And, you know, Lord, you're saying that you're going to start with Brian. I pray, Father God, that you would just bring this man to, to totally know you. And that you would bless his beautiful bride and, and the baby that's on the way. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Well, it was nice meeting you, David yeah. Bruce. That's easy for me. Yes, thank you. And is it Stephanie? Yes, Have a good night. Nice to meet you. You're, you're the most interesting person. Oh, wait, we, we wouldn't freak out. No, I'm not freaking out. You're it's one in a million at our church. Right. <laughs> Well, we if we go to church, um, but I don't. Yeah, you should look our church up online. It's strange. This sure, is some of the church. things that you touch on. We'll call it's almost. It's almost a lot of things like how I feel. I'm gonna call you tomorrow no. if he doesn't have his headache. Right. No, it's, it's. I mean, it's it's serious. There's there's a lot of things that you. We were said. just talking about that at dinner. <laughs> What's that? About about his dad and about, about how. My dad how his family in California, he's everyone's favorite, but here, he doesn't open up as much. Right, I'm guarded. Yeah. You know, he does his work. Well, uh, on when I started to speak that, family. I started to cry, so I knew there was something going on. In John chapter, or Corinthians 14, it's, just, it's, called, a, it's called a spiritual gift, it's called prophecy. The Lord just lets right. people know things about people. Right. Just so That's you what I mean. Encourage. It's not, not that it's, I don't know, weird's not really the word. Right. It's just, you got a gift. It's awesome. Isn't it? it is. It's awesome. It is. <laughs> it is. <laughs> You know, you call me maybe, you know, during the week or in a month or in a couple of weeks and we'll talk. It'll be cool. And go to the website, check out some of the songs. My first friend, I've got a dot com, but go to MySpace, it's pretty cool. And the first friend, it's got a picture of a, a 12, 14 year old boy playing a guitar. That's me when I was a kid. And it's got some worship music. Click on that, it's called Dave Bruce Worship. It's got some of the worship music on there. Hi, and we'll, uh, we'll now, have you, you, you've been in the church going for a long, long, long time? Yeah, it's like two years. I'm not really. What did you say? 22 years. Oh, 20, I thought you said two 22. years. I'm like, uh, I'm not too much into that's what's going to help you. It's really knowing the Lord, you know. Right. You know, we went to teach my philosophy. Is the same. It doesn't mean that you know the Lord just by going to church. Right. Or you're any better. Or that right. you're any better than anybody. Else. No, I think you just met up. You know, um, I, I walk in prophecy, and you, you just met me for a reason. Right. And you left, and he wants you to know he wants you to come up higher. You know. Oh, it was nice meeting you. Yeah, you too. Nice meeting you. Take care.